I've got a super sick t-shirt on. Look at this little nugget. Who wants to do him skincare too? You wanna do his skincare? Oh, now you wanna get down? Fine. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. We're here with a nighttime get on ready with me. I feel like right now is the best time ever to like dive into some really great skincare routines. So I thought since I had all this makeup on right now, I am gonna show you some of my favorite products and what I've been getting on ready with for the past few months now. This video is in partnership with Billy. You might recognize them as a female first run brand. They believe fewer ingredients, the better, like lip balm should have a bunch of nasty stuff in it and I love that. And we're gonna touch down on their new collection which I touched on in an Instagram video recently. You might have caught that and a lot of you guys actually went out and grabbed this product because of how awesome it is and how they created it. You also may know Billy from their Insta-worthy razors. Like they're super cool. They have some really fun videos out there. I actually just was watching 90 Day Fiance again and I saw one of their commercials come up and they just have the coolest like eye-catching inclusive rad commercials. So super excited to be working with them on this and there are two products in this video that work really 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 well with the Billy Wonder Wipes which I'm gonna talk to you about there's literally a gnat I accidentally left the downstairs door open and they have just like they're like I see the light at the end of the tunnel take me Billy formulated a new collection of beauty daily beauty essentials that basically put women's health and bodies first when formulating all these and creating these so super super rad I'm gonna touch on a couple of the other products in the collection because I think you guys are gonna love them. First we have Floof, which is a dry shampoo in this super, super cute little packaging. They have two shades of this. They have dark and light. So you can pick whatever shade you're going to need. And I don't know about you, but this package is so freaking cute. Floof is made with ingredients that fight excess oil, giving your hair that really nice clean look. Also, it's part volumizing. So really great for people like me who have nice, thin, flat, dead hair. Next we have the Super Salve. This comes in actually five different flavors, two of which are clear in case you don't like balm that has color. Personally, I have very small lips, so unless I'm wearing like lip liner and stuff, I like clear shades. So there are two for you to choose from if you just want a clear look. One rad thing about this lip balm is that Billy believes that you don't need to have but a handful of ingredients in order to make a really bomb lip balm. Bomb lip balm. Anyways, the other shades have like a nice gentle wash of color. And some of the ingredients in here that I wanted to go over with you guys that are super rad is um, candle lila wax. So it's a, it's a go-to vegan beeswax alternative. Vitamin E, avocado oil, and sunflower oil. Really great ingredients. So this has been really nice. I have not been drinking as much water as I've been supposed to. <laughs> so these are really, really nice. And there are five flavors to choose from. So depending on what look you want and flavor, they've got you covered. Uh, before we get into one of my favorite products that they make, they also make some body wash and some other really great things. So definitely check that out. But let's go ahead and get into the routine and um, I'm gonna show you one of my favorite new products. I have always been such a, a weirdo about making sure there's like all the makeup off of my face. So this next product I'm gonna talk about, I think you guys are really gonna love because I know that a lot of you have very sensitive skin like myself. Almost every makeup wipe that I've ever used has been really harsh on my skin and makes my skin feel kind of tight and dry after or like leaves like a nasty sticky residue. These don't do that at all. These are like my favorite new makeup wipes. Also, there is a skincare routine all in one in the wipe. It's basically a serum infused wipe. Not basically, it is. So these are the Billy Wonder Wipes. First of all, they smell amazing. So I'm actually gonna start removing my makeup with these. Aside from smelling absolutely amazing, they work extremely well. So they're super, super thick and look how much makeup they remove. Like, look at that. They're very thick and durable. So they really, really help you remove your makeup gently. Um, they're not flimsy, they're alcohol free, they're paraben free, they're toxin free, and they are actually infused with hyaluronic acid to help hydrate your skin. They're infused with vitamin, a vitamin C serum to help even out your skin tone. It's like, it's, it's skincare in a wipe. Like, the thickness also just really helps gently remove your makeup, which I love because a lot of makeup wipes just totally fall apart. And you know what? 
These are freaking awesome for camping because look at the amount of makeup that they remove. Like they smell so freaking fresh too. I could like eat them like, but, but I won't, but I won't. They're also plant-based and 100% biodegradable. Like I don't know about you, but every time I like use something that I know isn't, I get a little bummed out. So super rad that these are completely biodegradable. So you're not hurting the environment when you use them. So as you can see, this basically just like melts makeup off. Like it just comes off so quick and so easy. I keep looking at my monitor, I'm like, I just, it's kind of amazing. It's a wonder wipe, it really is. They also have shea butter in them, which is really tough on makeup, but not on your skin, which is why after you use these, you're gonna feel refreshed and hydrated and you're not going to feel like that tight, stinging alcohol kind of feeling because a lot of makeup wipes have alcohol in them and these do not. Um, of course, they're also cruelty free. Anything you see on my channel is cruelty free. And so right now you can actually get these for $9 with free shipping by using the link in my description box. And you know what's also really rad about these that I've never seen before is you can actually get these subscribe so that like whenever you know like how often you use your wipes, you can actually just get these shipped right to your door without even lifting a finger. So you never run out of makeup wipes again. I swear when I don't have makeup wipes, it's literally the end of the world for me. And these are definitely like my new go-to. They're also pH balanced, which is really awesome. And for me, the cool thing about these, aside from everything else that I've talked about, is um, I have been really working on evening my skin tone lately and the vitamin C serum in this really works on that. And I have noticed quite the difference, um, including a couple other products I'm gonna talk about today. Like they just work really, really well together to help me achieve my skincare goals. I had to use a secondary one mostly because I had glitter on and it's like, glitter is literally just so hard to get off. Usually after using a makeup wipe to remove all my makeup, my face would be super red because I am so sensitive. But as you can tell, it's not red at all. And I literally just took all this off. Amazing. Because I'm breaking out a little bit here, I'm actually gonna go ahead and use the Dermalogica Clear Start Breakout Clearing Foaming Wash. Let's just go away. The face wash that I typically use changes on a daily basis depending on like the needs of my skin. If I'm feeling, you know, like breakouts coming on, like I got a little bit going on here, I will use um, a breakout clearing wash. And if, if it's dry, I'll use something that's geared more towards that, which is great about the wipes too, is that they have hyaluronic acid. So they help with that, all the moisturizing and stuff. Kind of just depends what my skin needs. This is a little harder to do in a room without a sink, but you know. This wash is also really good to use around the time of Aunt Flo if you are a female and uh, help prevent some of your breakouts or clear them up. I also like to use tea tree oil on my pimples. So the next couple items that I'm gonna use, well, I'll start with the first one that I'm gonna use next. It's Good Molecules Super Peptide Serum. Um, it's formulated with tripeptides to target fine lines, wrinkles, and dullness. It says apply one drop in the morning and at night before oils and moisturizers, but one drop really doesn't do it for me. So I actually usually do like three of these and I'll kind of just gently work this into my skin. With this routine that I'm showing you guys, I have seen my skin tone really even out. The first day after I used all these things together, I literally did a double take in the mirror. And I've, you've probably heard me say this before because I've been kind of raving about it. And I was just like, whoa, dude, like my skin tone is so much more even than it usually is. I mean, you're getting thrown off right now, but you know. Next is the um, squalene oil. So this is a lightweight facial oil that softens, seals in moisture and regulates skin's natural oil balance. And this says apply a few drops to skin in the morning and at night, let absorb for 30 seconds. So, and this is good for all skin types. It's like also like the cutest little dropper ever. So I'll put this on my skin and typically I will put this on my chest and my hands as well. Obviously I am a genius and wore the perfect shirt to do skincare on my chest tonight. So I guess I'll have to do it later, but I like to put my skincare on my hands and kind of like up to here. Um, also because a lot of times the chest, neckline and neck in general 
get left out. Your hands and your neck are one of the first signs as to how old a woman is. And so I have always, like I heard that once a long time ago and it's always stuck with me. So I never miss an opportunity to moisturize those areas. Also, if you get your nails done at the salon, make sure you put sunscreen on your hands before you put them in those UV light things because that will age your hands as well and give you age spots. While that's absorbing, I'm gonna do a little bit of under eye care, which I've really had to ramp up because Nicholas, my boyfriend, gives me so many under eye wrinkles. Like I'm always laughing and smiling when I'm with him. So I've been using lately the, I kind of switch up my under eye products depending on like what mood I'm in and what brand I feel like using, but I only keep the top brands that I've really liked in my cupboard. This is the Kate Somerville Retinol Firming Eye Cream. This is actually a really cool little applicator that's like super like, right now it's hot as hell in here, so I'm gonna use this. Usually this is too cold for me. It's like so refreshing and it kind of just glides on there without tugging on your eye too much, which is really nice. So I kind of put this all the way around and I usually do it right here too because I haven't had Botox for a while. It's a little wrinkly. Sometimes I also like to put this in my smile lines. I know that's kind of weird, but Dermalogica actually has a product that's specifically for like your mouth area to help prevent lipstick from bleeding up into your lips as you get older. It's a good one. Okay, so lastly, I will do another moisturizing step and I kind of switch up my moisturizers just like I switch up my eye creams, kind of just depending on like what I'm going for that way, that day and I kind of cycle them out. Like if I use like a Murad Retinol kind of like moisturizer, I won't use that every single day just so it's not drying on my skin. I haven't actually had an issue with it drying out my skin, but when I hear retinol, I tend to only try and use it like a couple times a week. So today I'm gonna to be using the Ultra Repair Cream Intense Hydration by First Aid Beauty. This is to help hydrate parched skin, temporarily help relieve minor irritation and itching due to eczema and other conditions. So this is super, super moisturizing and your skin basically just drinks it up. I wanna say like seven years ago, um, I was like peeling and my face was like scaly like a fish. And I asked you guys online, I was like, dude, what is like the best moisturizer that you know of? Because my skin is like struggling right now. And a lot of you guys recommended First Aid Beauty. So that's actually how I came to find them. I actually went to Ulta and bought what you guys suggested. So it ended up helping, but I actually ended up having to switch my birth control because that was kind of the reason why it was happening. And on the hands and fingies, I'll link you guys to everything that I'm talking about in the description box as well, just so it's like easy for you guys to find it. I would love to hear too, like what you guys are using lately that you really, really like. I get a lot of like product inspiration from you guys. And that brings us to the end of uh, this video. We just completely got unready together. The only other thing that we need to do is give my armpits a bird bath, actually, since we have the wipes here. <laughs> Might as well just go ahead and use these. These are perfect since they're nice and thick been a little hot, you know? I'm gonna finish off today, tonight, it's actually tonight, tonight's skincare uh, with the Super Salve. Oh, it's so silky. This one is actually the uh, parsley one, and it is, I don't smell any parsley, but it does feel really good. This is just the clear one. Thanks for watching, you guys. Hopefully you enjoyed this video, and I'm stoked to introduce some of these products to you that I've been using, um, especially since so many of you guys have sensitive skin like me, and I've heard and read so many comments about how so many makeup wipes don't work for you. So I think you guys are really, really gonna be stoked on these. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, don't forget to let me know in the comments below and everyone else reading in the comments what some of your favorite skincare products have been lately. I'd love to try them out while we're in quarantine. Like skincare has kind of been my jam. So I look forward to reading those and I will chat with you guys in my next video. Thanks for watching.